cake, yeah, hey, all about cake, yeah, hey, come and relate, uh, uh, come and relate. Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Akila, also known as Akila Amazing. And today I'm gonna be sharing with you guys all the details about this braided wig from Neat and Sleek. So just a little bit more information about the wig. This is a 13 by six lace frontal wig. She is waist length and her name is Ava. I'll definitely be sure to link it down below. This is what she looks like straight out of the packaging. As you can see, we have a little baby here in the front. This is the construction some combs as well as an elastic band but can we talk about these knots though like she is giving very much scalp listen when i tell that these knots are bleached to perfection like girl i truly mean that but right now i'm gonna take this bonding glue from shea moisture's new wig and weaves collection your girl had a dope opportunity to partner with them so y'all definitely be sure to follow me on instagram and TikTok to see that. But let me tell y'all, when it comes to wigs, I like to just throw them on and go. But one thing I have noticed that when I'm out and about, them wigs, they be they be shifting a little bit. They be slipping and sliding. So I have found that it's so helpful to apply some type of bonding glue. Because the wig gotta be secure. The bag gotta be secure, the wig gotta be secure too. Like it's, you can't have one or the other. You gotta have both, okay? But I like this glue because one, it smells amazing, y'all. So good. And two, this will literally have your wig secured all day. And that, I'm not even exaggerating, like literally secured in place. Y'all, just check out the entire collection because they're geared towards caring for your hair underneath your wigs while also not ripping your edges out, you know what I'm saying? But anyways, now that everything is in place, I'm gonna go ahead and take some tweezers and I'll pull out some of these baby hairs. I ended up actually just ripping them out because there was a lot. Um, but I feel like that's a good thing because some people like more baby hairs on the wig, some people don't. So you can really customize it to what you're liking. I personally like baby hairs. I feel like it gives it like a cute little look, you know, just like a little natural look. So I'm using some uh, Gorilla Snot to uh, lay these bad boys down. When I'm doing this, I really don't have like a method that I'm following. I'm literally just cutting and styling as I go. And y'all forgot to mention uh, while applying the wig to uh, make sure that your base is as smooth as possible. Your ponytail, your braids, your cornrows. Listen, your girl is part of struggle cornrow gang. I am not the best cornrower and that's okay i could do what i need to do your girl can do a little some some and my hair is tapered right now so i tried to do some crochet braids i had an anchor braid in the middle and you know what i would not have been mad if i decided to just slick my hair down like i usually do but anyways once i was done i went ahead and tied up my edges with the scarf for about 15 minutes and this is what she looks like once she is done. Y'all, she's giving Moesha. She's giving very much brandy. As I mentioned, this is a waist length wig. And for reference, I'm 5'1". So this is where it hits. It hits right below my back. And this is what the back looks like. As you can see, you can see some tracks. So that's the only con about this wig is the fact that you do have to maneuver the braids in a way that the tracks will not show. If you wanted to avoid this, they do have full lace braided wigs, but it's still natural looking nonetheless. And one thing I do wish that I did is add some foundation to uh, the parting or even some Sally Hansen spray so that it matches more with my skin tone. So I would definitely recommend doing that. I attempted to do a little bit in the front, but I don't know. I don't know why I decided not to do it, but I definitely should have. But right now I'm just trying a few different styles, you know, some half ponies, a little bun look. You can definitely pull off a few styles with this wig. It's very versatile. And I just like the fact that you can just wake up and be like, you know what? I want braids today. That's one thing that I truly love about braided wigs. But this one is pretty bomb. I ain't gonna lie to y'all. Like the quality is amazing. What I love most though is probably just the fact that the knots come bleach to perfection like it's everything so convenient but yes you all let me know what you think down below in the comment section and like i said i'll definitely be sure to link all the specs 
down below so that you guys can check them out they actually have a whole bunch of different styles and colors as always thank you all so much for watching be sure to give this video a thumbs up and i will see y'all in the next one